And on the continuous rant of men disrespecting women, I, I like the way Alexandra Ocasio-Cortez ended that speech. And I liked how Ayanna Presley add on to that speech and related to her daughter. Because the tech yuhus of the world, we didn't know who he was. But he made sure he made a name for himself by calling her a fucking bitch and think that was not going to get reported. And then tried to have a, a, a feel sorry speech yesterday and thought he was slick. Well, it wasn't slick because Alexandra Ocasio-Cortez had a lot of women crowded around her and they were not going for that bullshit neither. And of course she had support from Senator Kamala Harris, who is the highest ranking black woman in the Senate. Or in Congress, period. Excuse me. So, to this Ted Yuhu guy, this Mark DeSantis, Mark Meadows, Jim Jordans, Dumb Dumb Matt Gates, and of course the Queen's rodent sewage rat in chief, Donald Trump. Talking to women overall, especially women of color, in a fucked up ass manner, will... In real life, we'll get your ass fucked up. But mostly, you will lose a lot of political uh, leverage. And trust me, it's coming. You, when your day of reckoning is coming, because it's coming, but it's it's coming very shortly, who's the one that's going to be crying? Y'all. Y'all the ones going to be out of the job, out of money, out of everything. Because what you do to women of color, especially in this time of racial reckoning, will have repercussions on your career, your livelihood, overall, and most importantly, your life.